loves us so he's promised us eternity and we can have that promise and be his if we have faith and just believe teach <laughs> So welcome back to my channel it's me vera that's voice everywhere accepts and if you're new here not yet subscribed please feel free to hit the subscribe button right below this video be sure to hit the bell so you don't miss out when i upload any new content like this one to my returning subscribers thank you all so so much guys without you this channel wouldn't be what it is so i'm really grateful to have you here today we're going to be reacting to my sugar daddy yeah gary valenciano mr pure energy yes it's been a while and a hot minute since i reacted to him and he's done a song and a few of my subscribers requested that i do this i cannot list all your names down because there's so many people that requested this particular video because it fits in right into the moment of what is happening in the world today uh this calls for us to get closer to god and actually ask god to review in us anything that's dark and reveal it to us so that we can amend our ways, you know? So without further ado, let's get right into this video by Gary Valenciano, Take Me Out of the Dark. And it's a live, raw cover. Just what is it in me? Sometimes I just don't know what keeps me in your love and why you never let me go. And though you're in me now, I fall and hurt you still. My Lord, please show me how to know just how. eternity and we can have that promise and be his if we have faith and just believe teach me to trust in you with 
with all of my heart to lean not on my own understanding cause I just forget you won't give me what I can't bear take me out of the dark my lord cause I don't want be alone take me out of the dark my lord i don't want to be there no no my Submit to him and he will make your paths straight. <laughs> Guys, sorry, um, I didn't have any tissue with me. Um, but there's no shame in my game. Yeah, there's no shame in my game. When it comes to God, there's no shame in my game. I would bow down, cry, worship God, even if it's on the street, even if it's in a swamp, even anywhere. But, you know, guys, um, I'm not going to say too much because I need to go back and listen to the song again. This song is going to be added to my worship playlist. There's something about Gary. Gary is such an awesome minister. And I'm so glad that even someone that is in a public eye like this, is still sold out to God. That's what's so amazing about this man, that he can do circular, but also still be a great minister for God. He can still touch hearts, touch lives. He's a perfect example of a Christian. He's a perfect example. You know, oftentimes, guys, I'll, I'll make a quick public confession to you. You guys know I sing circular song myself, but I grew up singing gospel. And... It's not like I slacked or slided out of church, but I went through a very, very um, devastating um, event in my life. And I didn't have the church there. The church that I grew up in was not there for me. The church that I dedicated to was not there for me in that season when I went through it. So I ended up hating church so much. I ended up hating people that went to church because I felt like they were the most unrealistic people ever they were so fake church was all about getting dressed on sunday wearing your best outfit and going to show off that's how i felt but you know i thank god that god took me out of that scene to be able to focus on him more 
Now, I still sing circular song, but that doesn't change who I am. It doesn't change. It doesn't reduce my Christianity. I don't sing circular songs about hitting people or killing people or doing drugs or sex and stuff like that. I do circular songs about things that are happening in our lives. For example, real love, reality, meeting someone you love and, you know, just just relating to real life stuff. And oftentimes I used to judge myself that, oh, you're not a good Christian because you're singing circular song, you're doing this, it's not Christian-like. But you know what? Gary is an example. Gary is somebody that I can emulate. Gary is somebody that I can look to. And I just love the fact that, he puts God in everything and he still ministers to touch lives. And this song definitely touched me, guys. Definitely touched me. Definitely, definitely touched me. And I am just so honored to have been able to come across such an amazing man. Um, so, you know, guys, I don't have much to say. But I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, I'm not going to apologize for crying. <laughs> That's just me. I'm not going to apologize. Um... But thank you so much to my subscribers that sent me this, especially my sister, Leslie. Thank you so, so much, Ate. Uh, I hope you guys are having a great Sunday and happy Mothering Sunday to all the mothers out there. Stay cool, stay blessed, and remain overriding.